the holy oh holy praise the lord hallelujah my brothers and sisters in christ welcome to the holy of holies thank you for listening to this episode and may god bless you with his peace and love subscribe to our youtube channel afcm florida also like comment and share this good news with everyone around you and together let us spread the good news of jesus christ amen i am also inviting you all to our weekly prayer gathering which is happening every wednesday at 7 pm est if you cannot come for physical gathering please join us through zoom facebook and youtube live together let us come and worship the lord and receive many blessings and graces amen before we listen to the word of god please join with me together let us ask the intercession of our blessed mother please pray with me hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen alleluia what is the gift of piety The gift of piety enables us to worship God as our father with the filial love and it also helps us to relate with others as our brothers we may find peace and fulfillment in the service of God while serving others my brothers and sisters in Christ we read in the second letter to Timothy what can lead us to into more and more impiety let us read second Timothy chapter 2 verses 16 and 17 avoid profane chatter for it will lead people into more and more impiety and their talk will spread like gangrene praise the lord avoid profane chatter for it can lead people into more and more impiety avoid every worldly talk and empty talk the talks that are away from the correct teachings of jesus christ the talks that are corrupted can lead us into more and more impiety we have to be careful whom we are listening to the conversations that we are engaged with here saint paul is instructing saint timothy to walk away to keep a distance from all kinds of false teachings because it can lead people into ungodliness and unholiness we must be careful and cautious because it can spread like gangrene and destroys our soul my brothers and sisters in christ at this time in our generation we must be very careful to whom we are listening to and what doctrines we follow because every useless discussions every useless arguments can lead us to ungodliness we must be careful even in our speech we must be cautious because our our speech our profane chatter can lead others into ungodliness can lead others into impiety we are responsible when we speak praise the lord our speech must promote godliness and faith in others let our speech be gracious and holy and according to the will of god let us speak what is worthy of god amen so let us all pray for the gift of wisdom gift of discernment the gift of courage to avoid every profane chatter and the gift to speak rightly and according to the will of god let us pray together lord jesus we thank you and we praise you lord jesus we ask forgiveness for every moments that we were engaged with worldly talk and empty talk that are away from the teachings of jesus christ that are not according to the divine truths today right now we pray lord jesus for the gift of gracious speech let your speech guide others into piety and promote faith in them o oh lord jesus anoint us in our speaking lord jesus we thank you and we praise you amen god bless you all all glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit amen avoid every profane chatter the talk that spreads like gangrene praise the lord <music>